you as a graphic designer, you're leaving massive, massive results on the table if you're not using Premiere Pro and After Effects. Unfortunately, a lot of graphic designers believe that if they're using Illustrator, they're making color theory, they're going ahead with it, they can just send it off to the client that way. And yes, that does work, but a lot of people are asking me how to charge more money as a graphic designer. And the simple answer to that is one, you either charge more because you believe in yourself, or two, you use another software and get better at that, which is a high income skill. Now, the two high income skill softwares that I'm talking about here are Premiere Pro and After Effects. Now, if you have a logo and you can animate that logo, that then becomes not only a high income skill, but you're impressing you're impressing the shit out of your clients, basically. Then what can you do with that animated logo? You can obviously put it into After Effects, you can make a whole brand presentation. You know, just think about just sending a logo over to a client versus sending over a logo with the animation motion theory and you've also done a brand presentation which includes all the color palettes, etc. You can actually watch a video of me going through a brand presentation, it's available on my YouTube and my Twitter. I will actually drop a link down below if you want to watch that. That's where they take you through one of my brand presentations for one of my biggest paying clients. It was a huge project. It's a project I'm, I'm so proud that I, that I got to do. And a lot of graphic designers will not take you through this process. And I take it through for free on YouTube. You know, it's five minutes long. I'll talk through every slide that I've produced. And most importantly, I'll justify every single decision. Because as a graphic designer, that's what we've got to do. We've got to justify why we're doing things. You can't just make things because they're aesthetically good. That's bullshit. You know, there's a lot of things that look aesthetically pleasing, pleasing, but they've got no meaning behind it. So that goes with this high income skill of motion theory. If you're making emotion graphics, you've got to justify why you've moved the logo in a certain way. You can then justify why you've done that in your brand presentation. You're onto a winner. Just look at all the big brands and agencies like Dixon, Baxi, etc. Look at their brand reveals. That's what you that's what you're aiming for as a brand identity designer. That's what inspired me anyway. And I think if you add that to your archery, it will become a much higher income skill. So when people say charge a lot more money for your services, you can then use a high income skill to charge more for your services. That might give you that more confidence. It's like, and provide more. So here's me free. And literally, I'm not even joking when I say this. It, 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 it takes about 10 minutes. There's a 10 minute tutorial on YouTube how to learn After Effects. The very, very basics, of course, it's not high, highly advanced. I'm the same for Premiere Pro, by the way. It's not highly advanced, but if you learn the basics and you get the, the groundwork in, what's gonna happen then? You're gonna, you should do, you should get really motivated and you should wanna learn the advanced techniques of Premiere Pro and After Effects. And once you're in that rabbit hole, it's just, it's just a domino effect from there. It, it really is amazing and you should try it out. And it's the one way to supercharge your growth on Twitter as a graphic designer. So get using Premiere Pro and After Effects today. As it's your archery, if you add that in with Photoshop and Illustrator, you're going to become a pro. And it does take time. Of course it takes time. It's going to take six months of learning how to use each software. And that's just to get to an intermediate sort of level. Uh, but if you're at an intermediate level, that's, that's perfect. That's you know, that, that's much better than where you were six months ago. So start today, start today is the point. And you can level up your clients, you can add more stuff to your portfolio, you can make yourself more attractive to clients by using these methods. And really what can go wrong at the moment using Photoshop and Illustrator, uh, if you add two more tools, then what, what's wrong with doing that? Just, it literally, there's no downside to it. Okay, maybe, in, in, Let's say you never use them tools. Well, you still know how to use them. So there's no downside to this whatsoever. Get using Premiere Pro and After Effects today to supercharge your growth as a graphic designer and level up your clients.